Okay, people, tomorrow morning, 10 a.m., Santa's coming to town. Santa! Oh, my God! So we are in the Vancouver Christmas market, and since we didn't make it to Europe this year, we had to get a little piece of, like, kind of like a European Christmas market. So we're here. They're adorable. Let's see if we can go find some Glog right now. Glog! Thank you for watching our video. Please like, subscribe, comment down below, and ring the bell to watch more of our content. Thank you! If you head down Thurlow Street to the Vancouver Harbor, you will run right into Vancouver's Christmas Market. It is within close walking distance to many of the city's hotels. <laughs> What is a Christmas market all about? Something magical happens around Christmas time. Whether waking up to see many wrapped presents filled with gifts underneath the Christmas tree, or maybe the smell of hot chocolate and a side of freshly baked cookies. No matter where you are, there will always be something special, and Germany seems to have their own thing. Pretty little stalls huddled together filled with glistening decorations, handmade trinkets, and local craft. But where did this all start? The story begins in the Middle Ages in parts of the former Holy Roman Empire. It is said that today's Christmas markets are based off of Vienna's December Markt, dating back to 1296. Emperor Albrecht I granted shopkeepers the rights to hold a market for a day or two in early winter so that townspeople could stock up on supplies for the cold months. Then winter markets began to pop up all over Europe. Over time, local families started setting up stalls to sell baskets, toys, wood carvings, alongside others selling almonds, roasted chestnuts, and gingerbread. These were often bought as gifts for Christmas. It was the winter markets that eventually became known as Christmas markets. So it's about twenty dollars CAD per adult. I think it was seventeen or fifteen for her, so under seventeen. And there's a twenty percent off Black Friday coupon that you can use right now, all the way up until December 9th. Hi. <laughs> We can pretend like we're skiing. <laughs> uh, I think that's gonna be where the wine is. The wine. Flaky chewy pancakes, or a churro, or a chocolate, or pancakes. Oh, waffles. House. Oh, waffles. Time is here. It's our Scooby song. I know. What are you getting? Dutch mini pancakes with Nutella and strawberries. Yeah. Dutch mini pancakes with what? Strawberry Nutella. Mm -hmm. mm. Gingerbread? Yeah, the gingerbread outside. The, um, I, I, I want to get one of those glass ornaments. They look really pretty. The blown glass ornament. She found a dragon that she really likes. Oh, and the mini Dutch. Yeah, the mini pancakes Dutch. Pancakes that we had with Nutella. Mm. And I'm pretty sure those were good. the pretzels are really good too. And the we mulled wine. Them. The apple cider. Yeah. Is it tiny? Say it. You should, she said, just make any noise in the sun. Apple cider. Come on! It tastes really good. Seven, six, five. Next week on McKenna Travels, come with us to Victoria to see the Christmas tree lighting ceremony at one of the city's oldest hotels. Thank you for watching our channel. And please subscribe, leave a comment below, and ring the bell for our next video notification. We'll see you next weekend, guys.